Okay. So me, Adote Berima Clen Clem, who likes to be referred to as Ayara Safo, is the owner of the popularly acclaimed cancer and chronic disease herbal center. The objective of the center is to create awareness of the use of traditional medicine against orthodox medicine. The center has been running its ads on TV3 for the past four months or so, and how it has helped cure some Ghanaians with cancer and some chronic diseases. Uh, Dr. Dute, who is an advocate for herbal medicine over orthodox one, says sanitizers are a bad resort in the face of the COVID-19 outbreak. He says hand sanitizers could cause throat cancer and problems with one's thyroid. Our conversation with him this morning, which will be over the phone, is to question this assertion in the face of panic and rush for the hand sanitizers, which experts world over have recommended as the world battles with the novel coronavirus. Uh, we will be joined shortly on the phone. Oh, he is on the line. Good morning, sir. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well. What chemicals are in these sanitizers that make it uh, dangerous? Well, before I go on, I'd like to uh, make a, a correction here. I'm not Dr. Adoti. Okay. And I, I will never be Dr. Adoti. I'm okay. very suffer. You're, you're, you're what? I are a suffer? Yeah, I suffer. Okay, so your problem is that the title no, doctor. No, no, no. I will never answer to that. All right, so let's now, go straight to, to the issue. Are hand sanitizers yeah. dangerous and be, why? Be, a, a, again, I'd like to thank His Excellency the President <coughs> for his quick move to, you know, curbing the condition. You understand? They are coming, the, the problems. Okay. Now, um, sanitizers, are, I mean, the active ingredient there is alcohol, okay? Mm hmm do you understand? Now, right. clear, clearly speaking, anything alcoholic is not good for I mean, for human consumption. Do you understand? Yes. Just, just as they use, I mean, methyl ethanol to derive, you know, um, uh, products from herbs to come and then, you know, sell to us you know, which are so dangerous and bad. It's the same thing with, you know, um, sanitizers as well, you understand? Now, the whole world is agog with the use of sanitizers all over the place. And I'm asking, why sanitizers? Because sanitizers can give you cancer, especially thyroid cancer. You haven't you told know, us maybe, how it gives cancer. No, no, no. You know, the, the constituents, I started by telling you of alcohol. Anything alcoholic could lead to anything cancerous. I mean, that's basic, without having to delve into the constituents of, you know, um, sanitizers. Do you understand? Anything alcoholic is bad. It's not good for human consumption. We are either. not drinking the sanitizers. We are using it you, on our hands. Eventually, it, it will find its way into your stomach. How? The sanitizers go through your pores. Okay, they go through your pores, through your skin. The sanitizers, just as you, you do a bit of brushing on the lips, you have it. Sanitizers easily penetrate the, the, the what do you call it. And madam, this is serious, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, especially our kids, our babies, mm -hmm. what are we going to do to them? Before I come to the babies, even we as adults, you understand? Sanitizers give us thyroid cancer. I want someone to come out there to, to, to deny that. You well, know, I, 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 I am yet to be us. I am yet to be convinced about so you know I, sanitizers I, I causing cancer. Make... So so yes, so well so, well well well. But, but I I want to ask <laughs> you. So what are the alternatives? Say again. What are the alternatives? You're saying we shouldn't use hand sanitizers. The, what should we be I using? I thought you were going to allow me extra shit a bit, so no one tells me I've just been you know like you know. I want to explain a bit. Because you're going on and on, I'm not getting the explanation. Oh, okay. Yes. Well, um, you're asking about alternatives. The best one is lime. Lime, lime. kills any virus on contact. Yes. Okay. Lime juice. I'm asking the whole Ghana to use lime juice. Lime Especially juice. Especially not lemon. Lime juice. Mm. Lime kills any gem that comes into contact with it. Especially when you add salt. 
Okay. You understand? So we should squeeze the if line and add salt. salt. So I am asking Ghana, they should stop using uh, sanitizers now and up and use, you know, lime juice plus salt or even without salt. You understand? Okay, Is go ahead. Okay? Yeah. Now, I was saying that, mm -hmm. you know, um, apart from the cancers, one could also be, fall into coma just as a, as, you know, as a result of the use of, you know, sanitizers. You may have other... You other could fall into coma. Conditions. I mean, say again. At what point do you fall into coma by using hand, uh, hand sanitizers? <laughs> you, 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 know, you know what? I have, I have a whole lot of people around now, and I don't want to sound, you know, so argumentative this morning. That's why I'm being very charitable. If I start, I'll be, I'll be forced to tell. I was trying to expatiate on the other one. You didn't allow me that much time. So I'm just trying to give the salient point. And whoever wants to debate, then we can come over and then debate that. I'll come to your studios very soon. You understand? Now, listen to this. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm, I'm even much more concerned about our babies. Are we going to sanitize them? Now, who controls them? As to when, as to, as to when they have to stretch their hands into their onto their lips, you know, and all that. What happens to them? You understand? And sanitizers are extremely dangerous to kids. Mm. And this is what uh, mm. parents are busily mm. issuing to, to, to their kids, you understand? So mm. please, I, I, I am asking His Excellency to now he voted so, so, so much so, money so. and okay. he voted so. so much money to the pharmaceutical companies to produce sanitizers. So, no. so we are checking we right now that. We are checking right now on uh, whether Lyme is able to kill virus, just so that we can educate the general public appropriately. So apart from Lyme yeah. and apart from Lyme and salt, as you're suggesting, what else can we use? Well, you know, basically, you, when it comes to our traditional setting, what we use for, for fungi, bacteria, bacterium, mm -hmm. talk of, you know, virus, is basically Lyme. Lyme kills, madam. Lime kills so, so we should use lime. So it's only lime you're, you're proffering right now. That's that's the only yes. solution for now. Yes. And okay. then sec secondly, when it comes to the application proper, you know, the way we've been taught, you know, especially when we want to go to want to eat, some are asked to use mm. soap to wash their hands. Oh, my mm. God. Before you have your meal, you have mm. to use lime juice, lime or lemon juice. You don't, you only can use soap after you finish eating, mm -hmm. you cannot eat any time, even before the advent of coronavirus. Mm -hmm. The most intelligent way to eat would have been first cleansing using lime or lemon juice, mm -hmm. you know, to to sanitize prior to eating. And after 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 eating, then you can go for the soap. Uh, and you may, mm -hmm. may have caustic soda introduced mm -hmm. into the system. You understand, mm -hmm. especially with time. All right. Do you understand me? I, 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 we are grateful that you made time to speak with us this morning. Ni Adote, Barry McClenkem, is also referred to as Ayare Safo. And he is saying that we shouldn't use hand sanitizers. We should use lime uh, with salt as, you know, uh, a replacement for hand sanitizers. He says hand sanitizers could, you know, affect your thyroid. Hand sanitizers could give you throat cancer and could actually put you in coma. I would want us to go by what the WHO says. We should wash our hands frequently and use alcohol-based hand sanitizer. So you make that decision. But we are trying to check uh, right now just to be sure whether Lyme indeed is able to kill James, my colleagues here. Well, mm -hmm. the, the, I, I think that um, he mm. perhaps is going back to um, the, the early days. Mm -hmm. um, salt is a preservative. It is. It also um, delays decay. Um, lime also does that. I mean, yeah. there are people who have made the argument about the fact that if you have lime or lemon and you put on fresh pork or pig meat, as mm -hmm. some would like mm -hmm. to call it, but it's it pork, would, yeah, you yeah. would find uh, the worms, you know, coming the worms out. come out. Right. So it has some level of potency. Mm -hmm. What we don't know is how far he has gone to test it because I saw you pushing him to give mm -hmm. you empirical evidence, evidence to suggest yeah. where, and I didn't get that term. Right. But I also think that perhaps he has done some study mm -hmm. that didn't come to bear in, in the conversation we had. Mm -hmm. I'm looking at the composition of um, hand sanitizers. 
carbonyl is in there, glycerin is there, is in there, mm -hmm. ethyl alcohol is in there, or ethanol, yeah. isopropyl alcohol, which mm -hmm. it says are the big problem. Mm -hmm. Try to mm -hmm. uh, no okay. lamine mm -hmm. and purified water. Mm -hmm. So his problem is mm -hmm. the alcohol, the alcohol, fact that yeah. it will sip into mm -hmm. Your, your, system. your system through your pores. Mm. We, we, yeah. will, we will we'll come, we'll continue this conversation mm. when we come back from yeah. the break and interrogate it further mm. by, by our research, whether yeah. lime is the way to go or the WHO's advice of uh, alcohol-based sanitizer the way to go. We'll so be back. Break. Okay, welcome back. And yeah. before the, the break, we're telling you about um, the alternative that um, IR Safu is, uh, is proposing. Yeah. Well, so we've been trying to do some digging. Yeah. But like, what have you found about mm. lemon, well, and lemon and fighting viruses and well the headline here says that mm -hmm. um lemon lime or vinegar are enough to kill coronavirus because the virus is fragile mm -hmm. and um there's a part that says that as much as they're encouraging people to use uh, hand sanitizers or 60 to 80 percent alcohol based hand rubs um lemon lime juice or even vinegar are effective in killing bacteria and viruses as well mm -hmm. and so then this sort of Corroborates his assertion mm -hmm. that lemon um, is a better option. Well, he says it's a better it's option. A better option. But from what I'm reading, it looks like this is also another um, alternative. Yeah. I, I, I don't want us to quickly um, dismiss what the WHO has said. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't also want us to quickly dismiss what, what uh, he's saying, saying because mm -hmm. there, there may be people now that we have shortage of hand sanitizers mm -hmm. in most places. I mean, lime could work for us. I mean, mm -hmm. even for basic detox, mm -hmm. people steam their food with, with, with lime, lime mm -hmm. you know, they cleanse things with lime. It has mm -hmm. some bit of potency. Yesterday yes. we were talking about, about its alkalinity, yes. yeah. uh, you know, strength. And yeah. so let's not be quick to dismiss it. Mm. I, I don't like the concept where everything obroni is better than everything, yeah. everything yeah. Beginning, yeah. you know. So let's not be quick to dismiss it. And that is also not to suggest to people that mm -hmm. you shouldn't use hand sanitizers. I would have wished to hear from him Seeing if, that, yes, yeah. if after you apply the lime and the salt, mm -hmm. do you wash it off mm -hmm. or do you keep it on your hands? Exactly. And what, what's um, the quantity you even have you to need. Absolutely. You see if you're, if, if yeah. Make sure what's mm, your quantity mm, mm, mm. because you, it, it, sometimes it can get uncomfortable when you it, use lime exactly. on your yeah, skin. Yeah, it can get long. sticky, yeah, it exactly. Get sticky. And itchy yeah. as well. Yes, mm. so then do you keep it on? Do you keep for it long? on? Do you wash your hands with soap and water before you apply it, or do you apply it and wash it? You want where kids mm -hmm. you would, you would cut it into yeah, two and, and use it in your arm armpit arm as yeah. a deodorant, right. yeah. you know, and it worked and it effectively. Worked. So, are you going to use that because? Back in the day at the Ghana Health Service, I remember that when we couldn't find soap or water or anything like that, uh, soap, we're told to use potash or ash, yes. you know, yeah. from charcoal. You right. use ash to, to oh, do it. Oh, ash for it, your... Yes, you, okay. you okay. use it. I thought for I was the, used for the teeth. Well, you, mm. you can you use can it use as well. Teeth, it's it's yeah. equally effect. The teeth is for... is charcoal, it's actually, charcoal, yeah. to whiten oh, your charcoal. teeth. Yeah. Yes. I thought it was ash. So, so, so plantain so, peels, you dip it in ash and then you... Well, it's actually, uh, ash is, is charcoal. Yeah, charcoal. It's charcoal. So yeah, now, then you dip it there are toothpaste with activated yeah. charcoal, yeah. that's what they yeah. call yeah. it. Yeah. You know, I'll choose the natural one. So mm. we're not saying you shouldn't use your hand sanitizers. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's it. We would interrogate it further. Yeah, exactly. But we want you to be safe out there, no matter mm -hmm. what. So yeah. if you can't find hand sanitizers and mm -hmm. you find uh, salt lime. and lime juice, please uh, use that one as well. Stay, yeah. stay I don't, safe. I don't know what you hands. make of him saying that the hand sanitizers will give you cancer. I mean, that's a bit... Well, we need to find out. Well, well, and so he's, say, he's saying that really. because it sips into your body. Your body, yeah. Okay, yeah. so anything that you apply, because you have a lot of pores, and yes. I'm not a medical doctor, by the way, but because you have a lot of pores, there may be suggestions that it could get, it could into, get into, your, into your stream. Right. Yeah. You know, which is why sometimes if you buy an ointment mm -hmm. to treat your leg, mm -hmm. for example, deep heat, and yeah. you yeah. apply yeah. it yeah. and yeah. it gets, in, it seeps it. in. So, yeah. so maybe, maybe he's using that same explanation. We should focus more on washing questions. our hands mm -hmm. frequently mm -hmm. yeah. and maybe cut down on the mm -hmm. frequency mm -hmm. at which we use hand sanitizer. Well, we need to find out from experts. If you ask me, I think that we still need some advice from other people right. as well. He has said what he thinks yeah. and he yeah. knows. Mm -hmm. Let's find out from the other people who are pushing the agenda yeah. for sanitizers. Mm -hmm. Do you know of the other side effects? Mm -hmm. And if that's the case, what yeah. should be the alternatives? Mm -hmm. Science, Science is a very interesting you know, space where mm -hmm. people come up with many different things. Right. I mean, the same people who did, for example, Pepsi, they are the same people who are doing close-up. Mm -hmm. the same people are, they are all scientists well, are you sure? who are, the you know, I'm the saying they are oh, same scientists, scientists who are doing yeah. the, yeah. Same, the same mm -hmm. things. Mm -hmm. Now, Mm. 
you find a base material in all of it, but mm -hmm. everybody has a small game changer in mm -hmm. there somewhere. Mm -hmm. So that's what we need to interrogate. Yeah. And, and we can't. But the bottom line is that live healthy, eat well, mm -hmm. eat your fruits and vegetables. vegetables. If you find citrus fruits, orange, apples, better, pineapple, eat them. Better, and yeah. I would, mm -hmm. I would at this point recommend that you eat the fresh fruits as opposed to the doing the, the ones. processed mm -hmm. ones mm -hmm. and okay, when the you say tablets. Fresh fruits. Oh well. So, so you go to so Kanishi, Abibloshi. Yes, mm -hmm. you buy fresh orange. You wash fresh it nicely. Right. You can cut it and yeah. juice it out. I and love eat orange. It. So yeah, I love it. Pineapple too, yeah. yourself, and so most of them are in season. So yeah. yes. go and I buy them. I see mangoes are back in season. Yeah, now, mango, so. mango is vitamin C yeah. as well. Yeah. It has so I'm citrus. excited about that. I love mango. Mango has citrus. Are people talking? Yeah. Uh, hmm. People, yeah, people yeah. are stalking. Yeah. yeah, listen. Yesterday, mm -hmm. I went. I, I didn't even know that people were panic buying mm. stuff. So mm -hmm. I walked into a supermarket because I needed a few things for the house, and there was a long queue. It was a long queue. People were really buying a lot of things because yeah. most of them were scared yeah. that you know yeah. there could be a shutdown, and if that's the case, they need to have things at home. At home, I, yeah. I, I mean, if your kids concerned. are home, you need a lot of food. Anyway, mm. so you want okay. To. Let's go wash our hands. We're going to, to wash, wash our hands. hands. <laughs> um, the the <laughs> conversation is that. Mm -hmm. uh, Okay, you know what? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we were, we were, because we're going to wash yeah, our hands. I think that we should wash yeah. our hands. So ba back in Let's the day at school, hands. there's yeah. break time. So when the you class know, one go in, everybody's rushing out to go and eat. But we so. have to Let's wash, go our wash our hands. hands. Going yes. to, yeah. It'll be nice. Camera is full of us. Let's go. Yeah. Wash the conversation these days have been the fact that we've been asked to wash our hands with soap and water, mm -hmm. under running water, clean water, mm -hmm. but the taps are not flowing yeah, in certain true. places. So if you find a situation where the taps are not flowing, we have sachet water, water here. Mm -hmm. We have uh, bottled our water. own bottled water. But mm -hmm. what we've done is we've perforated this end. It has the tax stamp, so it's uh, certified by the okay. GRA. Mm -hmm. and and the FDA as well. Yes, so so what we're going to do is the IPC hand washing mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. soap, water, mm -hmm. we have sanitizers. Mm -hmm. So let's go first. You will have to moisten your hand. hand. Okay. Okay. So because I'm doing it on my own, okay. the concept is that you go that like this. Oh, oh. okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you moisten your hand mm -hmm. or maybe you can help me. Yeah, okay. I was going to do that. But yeah. So you moisten your hand and give okay. me a little okay. soap. Okay. Okay. And then you rub it gently. Okay. Like that. And then you're told you have to wash for 20 seconds. Yeah, so that's what the plus the IPC I'm doing. Okay. And then you scrape. Oh, okay. I see. Like that. Okay. You scrub like that. Okay. In circular motion. Like that. All right. And then you do this one as well in circular motion. Okay. And then you do like that. You can hold your thumb like that. I see. Okay. And then you can do this like that. And then you do this, you intertwine like that. Okay. And it's then past you do, 20 seconds. Well, so oh, it has, at least. Well, so it has to go at least 20 yeah, yeah. seconds. So what we're trying to tell you is that you have to wash well. Exactly. So yeah. when you're done with this one, you do like... Huh? Yeah. Okay. You hold it like that so you can scrape it in. Okay. Like that. I see. And then you walk, you check your nails your as nails, well. Your nails, okay. Okay. At so those who have nails and all that. And then, so yeah. you actually have to wash up to your, your wrist. Your wrist, okay. Like that. Okay. okay. So now we are ready to rinse. Okay. With okay. running water. Yes. With running water. Under running, water, running, water, under running yeah. water. So I'm rinsing. Okay. 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 We are improvising. So <laughs> yeah, improvising. This, yeah. <laughs> this is not, but you have yeah. to wash and make sure that all of it is gone. Okay. All the soap, the ladder is gone. Mm -hmm. And then you have your fresh, uh, clean hands. It feels actually clean and safe at this point. I can feel it. Mm -hmm. So when you're yeah. done, yeah, when I'm done, if it's in a washroom and you don't have fresh paper towels, mm -hmm. you don't need to contaminate it with um, the tissues that are there. Mm -hmm. You can actually dry out your hand mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. Which you can? Is, yes, in which some is, very privileged washrooms, you have the dryer. You have, yes, so hand yeah, dryer, yeah, which yeah. is UV, mm -hmm. but you actually can dry out and your hand like that. And this will dry it out. Yes, it will. <laughs> it will. It will dry it. You feel it. See, yeah. it's drying out. It's drying out. See? Okay. So, my, my mom won't agree to this because she say you're wetting her floor. Well, <laughs> but, the, but the point is that if you use a paper a towel, a towel yeah. okay, okay, a tissue, okay. what you do if you are using a tap, you okay. use the paper towel to clean to close because at this point the water will be flowing. Yes. Now you don't want to recontaminate. Okay. So you take the paper towel, towel then and then you, you use it tap. to close and then okay. you drop it. You drop so it. you don't contaminate yourself. Okay. Other people have also said that you pour a bit of the soap on the tap handle. Yes, some and people recommend that you yeah. wash it. As well. But right. eventually when you are done washing it right. and you throw the water on it, you need to close it. Close yeah. it back. So, so you yeah. use the you paper it. towel to and then, then you close it. It's actually easier. But I thought you have washed it with soap, so then you can easily But you have not 
you have not scrubbed it mm -hmm. and done all of yeah. this one to it. Yeah. You understand? Uh -huh. So now I need so hand, the hand sanitizer. sanitizer. Great. Okay. Just a little. Yes. After washing? Yes. You yes. still need the sanitizer? Yes. Yeah. You actually need to wash first wash. before okay. the hand sanitizer. Yes. And then you can go through the same Don't forget, process. I have to be alcohol-based. You have to go through we the same We recommend over 70. Like Sorry, in this case, I think we didn't wash the soap off well, so we're... Okay, yeah. we are having to... Yeah. yeah. Let me, let's wash it well. Okay. I think the water is... If you can open that... Open the tap. Open the. Okay. If you don't have someone to hold the water that, for that, you, Johnny well, demonstrates. Well, that is why yeah. I did that. You okay. That is why I did that. Okay. Okay. Or if you're using sachet, you can perforate and then use this. Okay. okay. Hold it like that. Okay. So and then you that's wash. it. Ah, uh, I think. I see. Yeah. Are you serious? Okay. <laughs> and you're fine. You're good to go. Okay, so you want to try that? No, please. You thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so you you don't have water at home, but we have at least showed you how to go about it. If mm -hmm. you can't afford the hand sanitizers, and at the moment, uh, try and use your li li lime, lime, lime and, and a bit salt. of salt, salt and wash it. And Don't go drinking the alcohol. It's for your hand, not mm -hmm. your... Not your throat One more thing as well. So they would say that you should dispose of the water immediately. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and so okay. yeah, because it contains the germs. It you does. don't want it. it does. To so sit. if you have paper tissues, you hold it like that. No, eh. no. But for eh. people who are using the jerry can or what? What do you call it? Uh, Veronica. Bucket. Veronica. Yeah. You know when you go to a shop, the the water is there. Mm -hmm. it's, it's it's in it. Yeah. So people keep washing. Yeah. So it's piling up. What yeah, do you do? It, that's, well, they are supposed I think to be that's wrong. They should throwing it out at some, water. some point. At not some point, at every okay, hand every, wash. Yeah. Mm. And as much as possible, don't encourage washing your hands in a bowl. Yes. Because that's a bowl of gems. Yes. You wash your hands. I don't know what you have. And you don't know what I have. Under running yeah. water. Yeah. So it has to be under yeah. running water. And because we are communal in spirit, sometimes we go to the chop bar. And everybody likes to wash in the, you know, nah. one bowl, and we are washing, and we are sharing the gems. Yeah, don't do that, Are you so we can't eat fufu together? Well, no. At, at in these time. times when the you are having has to do social distancing, the president says these are not normal times. Yeah, it's not normal mm. times. Yeah. Mm. Okay. I mean, if if I were you, I would even try bat and things, you know, because bat, bat, yeah. how? Bat, bat, bat meat. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, because you're not sure. Yeah, yeah, people chew it. Here yeah, in Ghana, oh, they eat, eat bats in Ghana. People eat monkey here in Ghana. Do you, do you, do you eat bats? I've eaten some before. Oh, oh my God. Bats. <laughs> oh, but they sell it. Now, I don't. Time to move. Mm. Go, go we to the... We see corona from go, a distance. Go to the... <laughs> no, no, but, but, I mean, all jokes aside, people eat uh, bats, monkeys, people eat adua and all of those What's ones. adua? Mm -hmm. Well, the antelope. Ah, the, antelope. People okay. eat dogs, people eat yeah. their pets, cats. Yeah. People eat ah, everything. Why are you yeah. your pets? Cyril is shouting cats. Cats are pets for some people. <laughs> they name them Daisy Cyril says and cats Joseph. Are pets. There's a Johnny Hughes. Um, <coughs> no, are you yeah. serious? No, no, yeah. there's no. a Joseph. The cats are Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, flocking so